So, I just came back from the protest at the Bowmanville Zoo where the group known as Dara is uh, protesting the treatment of specifically the elephant, uh, among other things, but specifically the, the elephant that we have at the Bowmanville Zoo. Um, and I went in there as uh, trying to be an independent journalist. Um, I had a good interview with one of the representatives from Dara um, after attempting um, dialogue with some other protesters, uh, which did not go so well. Um, almost got assaulted. Uh, not quite, but almost. I guess that's the uh, the price you pay for wanting to, um, to, to be independent and to just want uh, the truth to create dialogue. A lot of people don't want dialogue. Um, and I also had an interview with um, the director of the Bowmanville Zoo who, as you may s assume, um, categorically denies the mistreatment of the animal. Um, but, you know, Dara gave up, um, came up with some, some good, valid points and the director of the zoo came up with some some valid points. Um, all these videos are going to be uploaded by me. There's a Q&A coming up in about 45 minutes, which I'm going to film and just try to give a, um, a balanced view of, of both sides of the story. Um, uh, it's amazing, though, how some people, um, as you can see in one of the videos, um, just by attempting to talk to them, uh, how they react, and they seem to have, some people have, seem to have a uh, misplaced expectation of privacy out on a public street, um, which is, is completely wrong, um, but that's just the way it goes sometimes. Um, so yeah, but I am kind of like in this independent journalist thing that uh, started here. I went to a, a protest uh, in Toronto um, for Occupy Toronto. Not not so much as a, as a journalist, but to uh, just to observe and um, and s see what that's all about. I'm kind of liking um, I'm kind of liking this. You know, there's there's an aspect to it where um, you can be you can attempt to be unbiased. I tried not to let any um, any sort of cognitive dissonance because I've lived in Bowmanville for so long and I tried not to let that cloud. I just wanted to create a dialogue, um, get the facts. Um, I, they attempted, Dara tried to give me some some leaflets and stuff and I don't, I generally don't take anything from either side because any information that they do give out is going to be skewed in either way and it's not just the protesters it's the it's the business end as well the the, the Bowmanville Zoo will have information that they would want to get out that favors them and that's to be expected so I don't generally take any information from I take the information but I don't take the the physical information I do my own fact checking I do my own research because I don't want to lead down the the propaganda trail as it were um, but I'm kind of like in this uh, independent independent journalist thing so uh, you may be seeing this beard uh, do a lot more of it so uh, peace